Hello guys, welcome to NT Brothers. So guys, from this video, we are going to start a new video series on top 100 like questions on LeetCode. So in the series, our first video is going to be to some problem. So, so guys, let's understand the problem. So problem says given an array of integers written indices of two numbers such that they add up to a specific target. So basically what the problem says we are given a given an array and a target value and we have to find two elements in from the array which add up to the target. There is a condition you may assume that each input would have exactly one solution and you may not use the same element twice. So what this condition says it says each input would have exactly one solution that is for any particular input we are going to have only one solution and also we cannot use the same element twice for example suppose in in this example if nums is 2 7 11 15 and target value is for say target is equals to 4 so we cannot do like 2 plus 2 equals to 4 that would be wrong because we cannot use the same element twice all right so hopefully problem is clear to everyone so firstly you can think about the brute force solution so let's think so in broad, brute force solution what we can do is we can iterate over each element and for each element we can search for its complement here complements the complement of an element is target minus that element is the complement of a particular element so for each element we can find its complement in the remaining part of element all right so this will be our brute force approach because we are going to loop over each element and for each element we are going to find its complement so that will take n square time all right so first solution is big o of n square brute force approach all right now let's discuss the second approach that is hashing with two passes so in this what we will do is we will create a map containing element as a, as a key and its value will be the index of that element all right so we will create a map containing int comma int which will store key as element and value as its index all right so we will create a map and after that we will loop over each element and we will try to find the complement of each element in the map if we are able to find the complement of any element in the map that means we have got the solution and we will return all right so this is the second approach this is hashing with two passes its complexity is basically n time complexity and o n space all right time and space so now third approach will be hashing with sing single pass so what we will do in this technique is while creating the map we will look back in the map for the complement of an element all right it is similar to the previous approach but here while creating the map itself we are going to look back into the map if the complement of a particular element is there or not all right so this will take on time 
and open space all right so let me code the third approach i will first create a map of intent in and we will loop over the array and let me first create a complement variable which is equals to target minus nums i so we have created a complement variable which is equals to target minus that particular element now if map dot find complement if map contains this statements mean m find complement is not it means complement is there in the map so if we find then we will return i comma m of complement all right because we have to return the indices and if we are not able to find the complement then we will do m of nums i is equals to i all right and if we haven't find any solution we will return minus 1 comma minus 1 all right hopefully this solution will run fine so let's run the solution So it is accepted. Let's submit our code. As you can see, our solution is working absolutely fine. So, guys, this is our solution to first lead code problem. Hopefully, you are able to now understand this problem and solve this problem yourself. Also, guys if you can tell me my mistakes and give any feedbacks to me it will be very nice of you also you can find the video link when you are solving any question you can go to discussion section section and you have to search here nitin all right nitin pal dev and you will get a link of this video all right so guys thank you for watching the video and if you like the video do subscribe my channel thank you